Now there's a lot more functionality and a lot more technique that can be done with the three play and I encourage you to read the user guide and get the full functionality out of the three play. Now the user guide is available under the utility icon in the menu ring from the startup page but you can also get to the user guide right from the live interface. Right up here there's a little icon that you can click on which will produce a QR code. You can take any smartphone or any iPad that's got a camera and you can scan that with any scanning program and it will launch the manual so you can be looking at the manual on your smart device while the live production is running. Now once you're finished with the live production, you can exit out of the live production environment and you still have the ability to export some of the content that was created with the 3Play during the live event for use outside of the 3Play. To exit the 3Play, we click on the X up in the upper right hand corner and this gets us out of our live production environment takes us back to the page where we were loading our content in the beginning before we started our production and we did that with the import media tab but you also have an export media tab and this allows us to export any of the media from the game so if you click on the add button here you're going to see all of the events and all of the angles of each event all of the comments that you've made are all here and ready for you including the game highlight reel so we can go ahead and click on the game highlight reel and maybe there's a few other things that we want to get out of here I'm going to hold the control key down on my keyboard and just pick a few different plays that we want to export and use outside of the three play. Go ahead and hit OK and these are loaded into the export media panel. Now for each one of these you have the ability to choose an application so what is it that you want to do with this clip once you get outside of the three play. Maybe you want to go into an application and then there are presets for applications like different nonlinear editors. Final Cut Pro, Adobe Premiere, Avid Media Composer and many other editors so we've got presets for you but again that's just on application maybe you want to send it to a mobile device you want to send it to an iPhone or an iPad or an Android phone maybe you want to send it to a video server and again there are presets for different types of video servers available as well and again you might also want to get this out to the web so either Flash or Flash 9 is available from the media exporter now you also have the ability to choose the destination where you're going to send this to and this could be one of the internal drives in the three play or you could hook up an external drive and export off to that external drive as well. Once you've got all the clips set up and you're ready to export simply hit the export button to export all of the content for use outside of the three play.